Good morning, my Pro Touring fam. Spaghetti Sunday. Now, I know I said I would do the wiring on my week off, but I figured why not start today. Real quick, something I want to share with you guys. When you're doing the LS swap, a lot of the stock engine harness <clears throat> would not be used. Now, I already took out four or five wires that I won't be using. But before you do that, it's always good to plan ahead. Because when you're doing an LS swap, a lot of these circuits become free and you can use them for something else. For instance, well, at least with a Dakota Digital Dash, uh, some of the uh, wires you can't use. Because you have to use their sending unit in order for the dash to rewrite. Uh, for an example, your oil pressure and your water temp. Since you have to use their center units, these circuits become free. With well, my PSI harness for my PCM, I could use these two circuits for my fan controllers. And they just happen to be the same color. Look at that. So it's always good to plan ahead. And that way I don't have to try to find a way to get the uh, wires through the firewall. Hack up my firewall to, you know, get wires through. I could just use circuits that I ain't using. I mean, it's just copper and plastic. That's it. Just make sure you get a good connection before you do any soldering or uh, wire connections. Yeah. That's all I want to share with you guys today. Like I said, I'm always here to help out others. And uh, let me get back to it.